It is September 22nd. I'm taking the BMW to work. It's about 73 degrees out, which is pretty toasty for this time of year. It's supposed to be 92 later this afternoon, so definitely toasty. So it's a good day for a naked bike. It's not a good day, however, to be behind a semi pulling a big thing. Not even a semi. we're headed into work. Um, I should be able to leave early today because I have an upgrade to do over the weekend. So I should leave one before it gets super super hot and two just have some free time on the bike which is always a good thing. <clears throat> the old bike runs pretty good. There's a few things it doesn't particularly care for one being this expressway with the grooved concrete. The tires seem to twitch this way and that a little bit. It's not horrible, but it's not quite right. So why are we going? Because there's another truck. Oh, there's a truck and a pickup, both going slow. Oh, come on. It's a ram. There's no excuse for driving a ram slow. I have one. And I don't usually drive it slow. go expressway the whole way to work, which I've never done on this bike. I usually get off up here and then take some side roads, which is probably what I'm going to do, but I don't know, I could do it. A little boring though. It's also early, it's not even six o'clock. Yeah, I think I'll get off. Not a big fan of the expressway on this bike. <clears throat> Can't hear the radio well in the headset. Not because of the bike, just because I'm going fast. This road feels better, this exit. Maybe it's not quite so grooved. Now this is just plain asphalt. It feels fine. Not bad timing. The lights turning yellow as I get here.
How many wheels is this truck? We'd say it's not an 18 wheeler. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten wheeler. The question is, is this light gonna turn yellow? Let's let's go. Let's go like it's not going to. Same thing here. The other one is red, so that's fine. Probably actually don't need to be over here, but... Good timing. Gotta wait for the arrow. So, oh, 55. Should I double it to 110? Talking about the kilometers to miles conversion. lights on, whether I need them or not. So, looks like I won't have to stop. Come on. Oh, come on. Don't do an arrow. <laughs> I do love the style of bike. They call it a standard. Back in the day, it was just a motorcycle. But you're slightly leaning forward. You basically have nothing in front of you except for the headlight bucket. Which on this model is even cooler because you don't even have a gauge cluster sticking up in front of you. This one has the gauges in the headlight bucket. So you basically have nothing but nothing but headlight. I think people like to ride motorcycles because they feel like they're floating. On the two wheels, you're just balancing. And on something like this, like I say, with minimal fairing, or no fairing, but minimal headlight. Even more so. Start putting our turn signal on. Have to drive a little more defensively on this bike just because there doesn't present a big target like some newer bikes. <laughs> 